How's everybody doing? God bless. I put this video out a week ago on September 4th, about September 24th. This video was, he said this in uh, 2021 about the upcoming event that would happen similar to 9-11 on September 24th. Prepared. Prepare. So, he's from Germany. He's from Germany. So, they've been putting signs around Germany. This is just today. Thank you, Michael, for sending me this. Very strange. The Federal Ministry of Civil Protection and Disaster Relief has had posters placed all over Germany where it is clearly recommended to stack up on food. He had never done such thing. What do they know? So now they're putting up billboards. This is just today, just recently. They've been putting up billboards all over Germany to stack up on food. This is the video right here. It's in German. So this is confirming. This is a second confirmation of my video right here. Not only are they putting up billboards, he says to prepare right here. Right here, he tells to prepare. So this is a confirmation of what he's saying of the 24th and 25th. Right here. I know everybody doesn't see my videos, but I had some people sending me videos of other people just today. Just today put out videos, or yesterday, about this. So, yes, I knew about it a week ago. Thank you, Michael, and others that give me information about the 24th, body count. That's what this video is about, body count. I expect more body counts. I expect other people to die. Not only disappear, as I showed in this one, about uh, this one right here, Nathan, the he was saying the 27th of Elul, which is around the 24th and 25th, the 27th and Elul, 24th and 25th. I also had videos about everybody leaving the country. Everybody leaving the country. Born leaving, leaving the country. I made this. All of the musicians leaving the country. They are canceling their concerts. Body count. Things are stacking up. Body count. Right here. They're leaving the country. Bugging out. Bugging out, as I was talking about. As I was talking about Camelia Harris. All of our leaders are bugging out. She's leaving the 20, 25th and the 29th. The same time as, same time as uh, um, they're telling people about this disaster in Germany. That I'm assuming she's going to be leaving probably the 24th. For the 25th. Then somebody gave me this. A bunch of people gave me this. Thank you. Colorado. Handing out free bug out bags to citizens. And telling them to prepare for some sort of disaster. Thank you. So the day before 9-11. Fox 31 in Denver. Releases this strange and ominous article telling people to prepare for a major disaster. They're even giving away free bug out bags filled with emergency supplies. But why? They say it's National Preparedness Month and the quote theme for National Preparedness Month is protecting your legacy. The life you've built is worth protecting. But that doesn't answer the question. Why is Denver giving away free bug out bags? You see, here's the thing about Denver and most of Colorado in general. There is little to no risk of natural disasters in Colorado, except, say, wildfires, which is a summer phenomenon, for one, and for two, it only happens in heavily forested areas or grasslands, which is not in Denver. This is coming from somebody who lived in Denver for about 10 years. The wildfire threat to Denver itself is almost non-existent. So you can't say, oh, they're handing out these bags to prepare people for fires, because no. Some of the mountain communities or some of the neighborhoods that are closer to the mountains are out in open fields, sure, but that's not Denver. 
Also, Denver doesn't get major earthquakes, flooding, hurricanes, big tornadoes, or any other disaster for that matter. It's actually considered to be a safe zone by the elites. So why are they giving people free bug out bags and telling them to prepare? So let's read the article and see exactly what it says. Quote, Denver Ready gives free bug out bags away as part of National Preparedness Month by Nick Willis. An event being held from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. on Saturday aims to get people ready to respond to emergencies as part of National Preparedness Month. The Denver Office of Emergency Management is hosting two events during September as part of a nationwide campaign that will provide free emergency bug out bags to anyone in attendance. Those events fall under the Denver Ready Preparedness Program which is part of the National Preparedness Month movement, the theme of which is protecting your legacy. The life you've built is worth protecting. The Denver Office of Emergency Management's events for September. I showed this before. How many days are between these two days right here? 13 days, 14 days, 13 days. What did I show you before? The 9-11 and the second 9-11. How many days is this? 13? I showed you this before. There's 13 days be behind Julian calendar right here. There's 13 days. Somebody on my channel told me this. Thank you. There's 13 days difference. So <clears throat> there's 13 days. So 9-11, 13 days on the Gregorian, it's the same date. 13 days. The same as what he's showing right here. It's the same date, 9-11, the second 9-11. Second 9-11. September, September 10th, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. And then September 24th, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. You can register ahead of the September 24th event to ensure that you get your bag as supplies are limited. Hmm. So they had two events, one on September 10th and the other is on September 24th. As I said, 9-11, the second 9-11 is going to be on the Gregorian calendar as it was on the Julian calendar right here, 13 days, second 9-11. Now here's the thing that I find extremely interesting about the date September 24th. There is this strange connection to this exact date, September 24th, 2022. And a warning given out by the government of Germany. Here, let me play the clip. It's in German, so I'll translate it for you. Herren, liebe Kolleginnen und Kollegen. Dieser 24. Dear colleagues, this 24th of September, 2022, will be a day that remains in our memories. As a day we will say, I remember exactly where I was. So this strange warning is given out in the German government telling people September 24th is going to be a very big day and you will remember exactly where you were. Sort of like 9-11, right? What are the odds? He said that in 2021. That was given out in, in uh, 2021 to prepare. This was, this was given out this speech at, in 2021. I showed you this in my video right here. I showed it to you in my video. So, very interesting this too. Uh, Prince Charles says they are going to be mourning for 17 days. Wish for mourning 17 days. This is not normal. It's usually 10 days mourning. I said this on my other video. Why is this important? What is, what is important about this? If you go from when... When he said it, right here, or, or when she died, 17 days, 14, 7, 14, 17 days, right here, the same time period. So why did he say morning? Why did he come up with this morning? Well, right here in Amos 8.10, it says... Return, uh, and I will return your feast. So feast of trumpets. I will turn your feast into mourning. And all your songs into lamentations. Very interesting because this is exactly talking about the same time frame. Feast of trumpets. Feast of trumpets right here. 
basket of summer fruit, as I have talked to before. So it's very interesting that he comes up with 17 days, and it comes to exactly the 25th, right here, the 24th and 25th. This is also in The Simpsons, and I've showed this before. Listen to this right here. Clean out every supermarket in town. Typical sheeple. Clean out every supermarket in town. That's exactly what they're showing you right here. Stack up. So, what have you learned so far from our post apoc Show this before. Then he goes up here. And this there it is, is Homer. Springfield Prepper's Top Secret Bug Out Retreat. Wow! Your end of the world is better than my during the world! Homer, we all know America's collapse is about three months away. Six weeks at most. There's always one alarmist. Anyway, when the four horsemen ride, we want you and your collaterals right here with us. And all our supplies behind a fake wall. Not the basement, look, Lena. See? These are our bug out bags! Said this before. It's also what they're they're doing here. They're giving out the bug out bags again. They gave them out in New York City. Now they're giving them out here. The same thing as what I showed in The Simpsons right here. And it shows exactly what they're talking about. They're hitting the power plants right now. Uh, most people know that. In here is everything we need to survive. Survive what? The looming kablooey. Booming Kabooey, as I've talked about before. They are hitting power plants right now. And they are talking of exactly what they're talking about. As I showed before, this is the Ukrainian flag. Blue and yellow. Power goes out. Power goes out in the meteor. As I've talked about before, um... As I talked about before, this is body count. As I have talked about before, um, about uh, the meteor Didymus. Didymus right there. Didymus update right there. Didymus. This is coming on the, supposedly it's supposed to be here, the uh, fourth. So right here would be the nuke. And as I said before on the fourth, would be the fourth, would be the other part. So I'm going to go over review right here. Bug out bag preparedness. Thank you for this video. He talked about the dates as I did. You have all the uh, politicians leaving. They're either going to the funeral in Japan. The, the funeral in Japan. They're, she's going to be there the 25th. I'm assuming she's leaving the 24th. So... She's going to be in visit South Korea on the 25th. They are, I said, they're 12 or 14 hours ahead of us. So she'd be leaving on the 24th. I've talked about this before. Also, Biden's going to be out of the country for the Queen's funeral, which it should supposed to be on the 19th, but we'll have to watch. Here's the 13 days difference, as I showed you. This is exactly what they're doing here as far as giving out the bug out bags. 13 days difference. Here's Amos morning, as I told you, with Prince Charles right here, 17th day morning. It comes up to the 25th, as I showed you right here. I showed you this, the events. I showed this one week ago. I see a lot of other people are talking about this. Right here, this is in the Simpsons, the bug out bag. They are also talking about the power going out, as I have talked about before. Cyber attacks. In Ukraine right now, they are hitting the power plants in Russia also. So this is exactly what they're showing here. I showed you here where they're stacking up on food in Germany. They, uh, they are telling you to stack up on food. Right here, the Federal Civil Protection Disaster Relief and posters placed all over Germany where you can re clearly recommend stacking up on food. This is in The Simpsons, as I showed here. This is also um, points to the events, as I showed here. The 24th, prepare, he said. 
Didymus, as I showed here in my videos about the rock coming. They're trying to divert it. Um, and right here, she agrees with me as about, um, as far as Nathan, as I showed, it starts on the 23rd, uh, 27th of Elul. As Nathan said, on the 23rd, we have to watch Israel at this time, see if Israel starts getting attacked on the 23rd. He said, Nathan said they withheld them for three days. They, they attacked and they withheld them for three days. That would bring us up to the 26th. So we could get, America could get nuked around this time. And that's, I will punish the king of Assyria as I will punish the king of Babylon. That's in the Bible. So this could happen about the same time. We'll have to watch around the 23rd. But yes, I said this, uh, I had this video out weeks ago. I see a lot of other people a week later are, uh, I had this on the 4th right here and a week later i hear a lot of there's a lot of other videos on it so this is what i'm watching in uh body count september 25th 24th god bless